Welcome to Computune Support. On this uh, very quick video tutorial, we're going to explain how to force install the, the latest build, the latest version of Windows 10 into your system. Now, generally speaking, the, the rule applies of uh, if it's not broke, don't fix it. So if you have a particular reason uh, for having to force install uh, the latest version of Windows 10 or the latest build, uh, into your system, this is how to carry that uh, out rather than going through the usual uh, procedure of uh, repeatedly running Windows uh, updates. Now, first things first, let's go through this. Uh, we'll just get rid of that camera. Uh, bottom right hand corner on your flag on the start menu, we right click and uh, take system. Now this is going to, if we scroll down, uh, show us the current build that is in your system in and running and installed just now. Uh, obviously it's pointless me saying to you this is the version you should have because this particular video itself uh, will be out of date I would imagine uh, very soon. To run the uh, the Windows Update Assistant follow the link if you're watching this on the Computrune website um, then the link will appear on this blog post. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, I'll uh, make sure the link is uh, down below the video in the description. Okay, once uh, Windows Update Assistant page is open, we simply hit the big button that clearly says Update Now. Um, this is the Edge browser, so we have to just hit Run. Uh, in Google Chrome, it will appear down the bottom corner here. Just click it once it's installed. It doesn't take long. Uh, once that's running, I'll just get this into view for you here. Uh, as you can see on the system, well, you can see now uh, it's saying thanks for uh, updating the latest version of Windows 10. In other words, uh, I don't need to run it on this particular system. Uh, but if the version that you are running is uh, or has fell behind, um, then the instructions will be on the screen for you to uh, to follow uh, and it really is just a case of hitting next, next, okay and that type of thing. Um, and it's worth mentioning if you are running this, uh, make sure you don't have to use the computer for a good hour or two because it might take uh, quite a little while to go in. Uh, so that is how to run the, uh, or rather to force load uh, the latest version of Windows 10 or the latest build into your system. Thanks for watching.